my grandfather came here in 1898 when this county was, you might say, entirely agriculture. Um, my father and my uncles and my aunts uh, and my mother uh, lived here during a period when the community changed quite dramatically. Uh, as far as the so uh, social and cultural evolution of Orange County and uh, my own family's participation in those changes, uh, they occurred really with a population growth of Orange County. Uh, I hear people say that uh, Orange County was a cultural wasteland. Uh, I take great exception to that. Uh, I think those statements are only made by those or by those families that have not lived here during the decades that my family has been located here. Uh, we have, uh, as a family, uh, been involved uh, since we've been here in the social out life of Orange County and, the, and also in the cultural life. I think one must remember that uh, the cultural life in Orange County uh, early on uh, can be highlighted by the Laguna Beach Art Museum, uh, a very famous school of plein air artists, by the Bowers Museum, by the Muckenthaler, uh, uh, in Fullerton by many cultural institutions. Those cultural institutions, however, were limited uh, in their resources by the limited population base. Specifically in the relationship to Costa Mesa, uh, I would say that uh, our first semi-cultural gift to the city was the gift of Estancia Park. And uh, that was very important to our family, that uh, that, that be perpetuated and, uh, and kept as an institution within the city. It established Costa Mesa, I think, as, uh, as having had a, a very distinguished past, uh, as exemplified by the Estancia itself. A few years after that, uh, we were approached by an existing repertory theater in Costa Mesa, South Coast Repertory Theater, who had had a, enormous success. Uh, and uh, they sought a larger theater. So our family uh, saw fit to, to provide them the land resources that they needed for that expansion, plus uh, a cash contribution toward their uh, building fund. Uh, that really began our association with the arts per se as a business. Uh, after the theater opened and had enjoyed some period of uh, prosperity, when they came to us, we were highly confident that this community was now ready for, uh, for what you might say was the ultimate development, uh, a major hall which um, all communities aspire to and very few realize. Uh, the hall that has been created in Costa Mesa is an exceptional one. Uh, it's uh, one of uh, international stature as far as its acoustics are concerned. It's uh, receiving design uh, recognition by many other institutions who want to build similar halls, uh, less than a year old, were already being studied uh, as to how we're so successful, both from performances and acoustics uh, and design. <clears throat> uh, so I would say that, uh, that uh, when Costa Mesa and Orange County and the people who have supported this uh, the development of this facility put their minds to it, uh, they, can, they, they can do the very best.